We are now in the third week of October, and this is typically the time to see the best colors in the North Carolina mountains. CBS 17's Brian Hutton Jr. is live tonight with a look at how the colors are doing this year. Brian. Hey, Marius. Yeah, that's right. You know, last year at this point, we were running three weeks behind our peak colors. But this year, as we approach the peak of seeing fall foliage, the mountains are full of the reds, oranges, and yellows of fall. Vibrant colors fill the landscape of the North Carolina mountains as we now reach the peak time to see the fall colors. This week, the peak colors can be found around 3,000 feet, making them highly visible from the Blue Ridge Parkway and in cities like Boone. The colors are most vibrant in the maples, sourwoods, and birches. Heading up to higher elevations, like Grandfather and Beach Mountains, will quickly provide a drop-off in color. Once you get above 3,500 feet, the colors are now past peak, and in many places above 4,000 feet, the leaves are completely gone from the trees. The height of peak colors will continue to drop through the rest of the month. The week of the 26th will feature peak colors in places like the city of Asheville. The beginning of November will see peak colors to all of the Piedmont. While there are some nice colors around Central North Carolina right now, our peak time usually arrives around the second week of November. And now if you are planning on making that trek out west, be warned though that the beautiful fall colors have seen an increase in crowds on the Blue Ridge Parkway and other scenic routes. So take that in mind if you are planning a trip west. Live in Raleigh, Brian Hutton Jr., CBS 17 News.